everybody, it's Dagon Hills here. In honor of Easter, I'm going to make a beautiful chicken dinner. This is a huge six pound chicken. I'm going to roast it up. Then we have some Brussels sprouts and oil and seasoning. And then some beautiful yellow fingerling potatoes and olive oil and some seasoning. So it's all going to be cooked in the oven at the same time. So let's get to it. Okay, I have the chicken all patted dry and it's ready to go. Some people, they'll truss the legs together when they cook. I've never really done it, but some people do. It's supposed to help cook better. But you just pull them up and tie them together. So I'm going to put some seasoning on this. And I'll be back. Okay, well I have this big bird in this pan. Look how big it is. Like fits the whole pan. Well, I put some of this poultry seasoning, then salt and pepper, and a little bit of paprika on it. So we're going to throw it in a 425 degree oven. I'm going to cook it for about an hour and a half, really roast it. Then I'll put the Brussels and the potatoes in the oven as well, so everything's going to cook together. So I'm going to cook this uncovered, so let me put it in the oven. Okay, it's in there, and it's time to shut the door and let it do its thing. Like I said, these are going to be put into roasting pans, the Brussels here and the potatoes, and those are going to roast, but I'll wait a little while. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay, a while back I showed you this pot holder. This is the segment where I show you something from the kitchen. But this was given to me by a customer of mine. And I thought it was really cool. So recently I saw her and I said, yeah, that pot holder is awesome. I even put it in a video. So she said, hold on. And look what she came back with. Here, this is the new one. Look at that. Can't turn it around. It's the killer uh, superhero. It has the X-Men, Thor, Wolverine. It's pretty awesome. So she... Does good work. Look at Iron Man there. It's pretty awesome. So that's the latest edition. But she was so kind to give that to me. I think it looks pretty cool. Yeah, the more you look at it, you see different things. It's like they actually took comics to make the fabric. Okay, now I put the seasoned potatoes here on this pan. And then later I'm going to put the bristles here. But the potatoes have to go a little bit. So these are going to go in the oven now. Then I'll take them out and put the bristles here and cook it all together. So into the oven it goes. Okay, I'm going to put those in. But I thought I'd show you the chicken. It's looking great. I'm going to baste it a little bit. And then keep it cooking for a little bit longer. Okay, well, the potatoes are coming along great. They're starting to roast. So I'm going to put these brussels in and throw this back in. And before these are done, I think the chicken will come out because it needs to rest a little bit. So back in the oven they go. Okay, well, here it is. Look at it. It's just gorgeous. It's all roasted. Beautiful. Looks like it's going to be delicious. Now the... Potatoes and the Brussels are just about done, so this has to rest about 10-15 minutes, and those are going to be done about the same time, so it's almost dinner time, so I'm going to plate it up, and I'll show you what we have. Okay, well here are the Brussels and the potatoes. Look, they look beautiful. Try to get real close. This is super simple, so I'm going to cut up that chicken mix. Well, here it is, a simple and easy roast chicken dinner with roasted potatoes and roasted Brussels sprouts. Hope you enjoyed this. The breast looks beautiful. That skin turned out amazing. And for dessert, it's going to be this beautiful homemade banana bread 
with walnuts. I have a little vanilla ice cream. I think that would go really well with it. So, happy Easter, everyone. God bless you all. Hope you had a great holiday. And take care until next time. See you later. It's dinner time. Oh, I'm Jagger.